Hey guys, welcome back to another Arizona Insider video. Now, if you're new to this channel and you don't wanna miss out on anything Arizona, like great local small businesses, things to do in Arizona, places to go in Arizona, or having a native's perspective on living in Arizona, you'll wanna make sure you hit that red subscribe button. Anyways, uh, today's video, you guys, I'm pretty excited being a local to Arizona. Uh, we're going to talk about Central Avenue. Now, Central Avenue is as it sounds. It goes right through the center of Phoenix and is really the most historic street in all of Phoenix. Uh, but Central didn't really become Central uh, until 1895 when the city replatted, uh, showing all the streets east of Central and all the avenues west of Central, truly making it Phoenix's Central Line. Now, fast forward to the 1950s local steakhouse legend Durant's was open and is still open and still stands to this day and is pretty much all original inside. I'm sure they've done some upkeep, but nothing's really different um, other than patrons now enter through the back of the restaurant, through the kitchen, just like how they used to sneak in local celebrities back in the day. Um, now fast forward into the 1960s, a wave of high rise development in Phoenix uh, down Central Avenue uh, was something that happened and really had never been seen before in Phoenix. Now the Phoenix Corporate Center opened up in the 60s, making it the tallest building in Arizona, standing 341 feet tall. Now, fast forward to the 1980s, development on Central began to grow rapidly through the decades real estate boom, with a second wave of office towers, really giving it that city feel. Uh, and the one Camelback building was built in 1985 and is still stands at the central intersection of Central and Camelback Road. Now you guys fast forward to the 2000s and we had some freaking major changes. Phoenix voters finally approved the Transit 2000 Regional Transportation Plan, or simply put the light rail, you guys. Um, but having the light rail right down the center of Central is the most significant event in its history. It reformed Phoenix's future growth as Phoenix adopted a true transit-oriented city as opposed to just being automobile-centric. So having the light rail uh, right down the middle has really changed the way locals and tourists can access downtown area for you know work, uh, sporting events, dining, nightlife, whatever it is. It's really changed the way we can access it and locals can access the downtown. Hey guys, really appreciate you taking the time to watch the video today. Uh, when I shot it, I originally intended it for it to be a downtown video. So I recorded that drive down Central uh, and then shots of actual downtown Phoenix. So after looking at my footage, I decided to delineate the two uh, and do two separate videos because uh, Central is very historic uh, as it relates to Phoenix. Uh, so I thought it would be cool to tell a little history about Central and you get an idea of what it's like driving down through the heart of Central Phoenix. So to make sure you don't miss out on that downtown video, uh, consider subscribing uh, to the channel and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.